right, so here we've got the paint prep station. I'm taking the cabinet doors and drawers that have already been sanded. I'm using our paint prep, wiping them down, taking our C hooks, chatter's already pre-drilled all the doors and drawers, and I'm inserting the C hooks into the holes, and then I'm taking a hanger, putting it on the hanger, and putting it on our drying rack so that they're ready to paint. All right, today we got a special treat for you. We got a visit from our Sherwin-Williams rep, who also handles most of my Graco equipment, and who also handles our Fest tool equipment. This is Jason. Everybody say what's up to Jason. Oh yeah, How's you going? can't talk, that's right. Jason can say what's up to you. How's it going? All Glad right. to be here. He brought by a special tool for us today that Chatter's using. This is the Rotex RO90DX. So the RO90 essentially would replace our oscillating tools with the corner attachments. Let's take a look. The Rotex 90, it's a dual mode sander. So this mode right here is a gear driven. It's gonna extreme coat removal. Um, like it takes two hands. Really? Yeah. Then this mode would be orbital. So it's just gonna do your finishing sanding. And this last mode is your triangle. So this is for corners. This cheap plastic. Yeah, really. So you want to try not to press down because that'll just wear this out. Yeah. So you want to let the tool do the work. Make sure you filter your paint. This is a big deal. You don't want clumps and boogers up in there. Filter your paint.
All right, so what Chatter's doing now is he made a little jig to install the hinges to make sure that the new screw holes line up because we're using the same cup pattern of the old hinge with new screw holes. So you want to make sure that they are level, they are square, they are lined up, every single one of them is the same. So you make yourself a jig, and that jig helps you line up every single one for continuity and consistency. All right, everyone. So, essentially, we met the deadline for Thanksgiving. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're out of here, and Thanksgiving's in two days. We can't work tomorrow because they have family coming in tonight. So, they have a functioning kitchen. We got what we needed to do done for Thanksgiving. Yes. For the client. Above and beyond. Yeah, and we had to go above and beyond. A yeah. lot of these cabinets, unfortunately, the glue at the seams Excuse me, the glue at the joints had failed under the vibration of sanding. So, I mean, there was a lot that had to be done. A lot more than we anticipated. A whole lot more. A lot. All right. So. Word. All right. Till next time. Thanksgiving here and all your friends and family came over? Yes, yes, we had such a great time in this beautiful new kitchen. What was the general consensus? I mean, when everybody came, they were like, wow, what did you do with the kitchen? And they're like, did you do like an extension of the kitchen? Did you like make it bigger? I said, no, we have not done anything except just change the colors, you know, of the cabinets and the countertop. And that made all the difference. It's amazing what just changing colors yes. can do to the, the overall feel exactly. of a space this this Exactly. This I mean, yeah. and Adam did a wonderful job. I would recommend him for everybody. Thank you so much. It's been a pleasure working with you, and, and I think we might even back, be back here to do some, uh, some hardwood floor more, refinishing. And yes, and more new projects. Absolutely. Well, this is also a beautiful home, and we're excited to come back. Thank you. Thanks, Adam. Bye-bye.